All right, you just saw it got pulled over for this, so got to be a law-abiding citizen. Yeah, this is so much fun. There's so much stuff I got to do to this to make it legal for a road trip. I love taking 10 off of vehicles. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. As you saw in that opening clip, we got pulled over the cops in the trailblazer because that front windshield tent, it's off now, but you can actually see through it from the inside, see through it from the outside. But me and Tony are taking a trip down to Atlanta for Import Alliance. So there's just a couple things I need to square up to make sure that this is 100% ready, good to go. Like that front windshield tent, like getting that off that way. No cops pull us over, harass us to make the drive longer. But in addition with that, I need to get these headlights fixed up here. One's out and the one that's still there isn't like all necessarily bright. In addition with that, gotta get the steering wheel position sensor fixed because it turns stable track on and off randomly. So it pulls power away from me and I hate it when I go from having that 500-ish horsepower drive and then it pulls timing and then by like seat of the pants feel, it feels like it's 400 horsepower. So I'm gonna go ahead, oh, that steering wheel position sensor. Uh, fix an airline in the back that's leaking causing these bags to lose air randomly because the previous owner deleted the compressor because it had gone out so he just turned it into a manual kind of thing and then in addition with that just doing rear shocks for the rear stiffen it up for launches corners stuff like that but other than that i'm gonna get at it guys because i don't have much time to lose all right so i popped the hood so we can get to these headlights right here i'm using these 30 dollar headlights that i got off of amazon they're led i already popped it open they look solid so we're gonna run those but to get these headlights out because the grill's in the way i gotta pop these tabs off for the grill there's one behind here another two down there and then two back behind here so i gotta pop those out and then there's just this tab and another tab back here. I don't know if I can show you it. I can see it, but yeah, there's just a couple tabs. I got to pop out up here, be able to pull the headlights out, get the wiring out and get those done. So I'm going to get started on that right now. So stay tuned. All right. So what you saw, I just took the grill off. There's just a clip on each of those headlights. Clip up here, clip right there, clip right there, clip right there, <laughs> clip right there clip right there and then a clip right here in the middle and then two more over here on this headlight and then here it should just be pulled straight up where's the other one? Oh, it just pulls out all right cool so there's that right there and then let me set you down real quick to get a good representation of pulling these headlights out And this is just the back of the headlight. Oh, sweet. That light came out. Nice. But just popping these off, doing that, putting the new headlight in, and then it should be good. So I'm just going to get that done, and I'm going to come back to you guys. 
Alright, cool. That first headlight's in. These new headlights right here, they look like this. They're pretty easy to get in. They have that fan on the back to cool them down, too. So they don't overheat. You don't want overheating headlights, etc., etc. Um, but it's pretty simple. I'll show you guys this one how to do it. But that other one went in pretty easy, so we'll get to this one right now. So this one's going to be a little tricky because they put the connector in that way. So it's not going to be fun or easy to get out at all. Alright, so after a little bit of persuasion, this one's out. So we're going to get this one in right now. I'm not going to show you that because this one's probably going to be not that fun to get into. But then after this, I'll show you with them on to show you what $30 Amazon headlights look like. But then after that, we're going to move on to the steering wheel position sensor, which is also going to be tons of fun. Alright, so both of those are in. It's not cooperating with me right now. It might just be a weird sequence to turn the lights on, or I'm just dumb. One of the two, but it's off. It's looking good. My GoPro is acting weird right now, but you can see this girl's off. There's more than enough space, like down here or back in there, for a heat and ex <laughs> heat exchanger for, say, a supercharger. But we don't know yet, so I'm gonna get on to this next little bit now. you guys just saw that but the old shock is out right there here's the stock factory one and then here's the new one going in it should help it out a lot but let's get this in it's getting windy so i don't know how well you guys can hear me so back to it all right guys sorry i haven't been time lapsing you can see those in there shocks are in on the driver's side but than what it was solely relying on those airbags that way it's a coil shock and airbag system all together and the back end suspension has heavier than the front so launching it will be better and it'll sit on the back wheels instead of all four like the all-wheel drive needs but i'm gonna get this other side in and then i'll show you the steering wheel position sensor all right, so wasn't able to get to the steering wheel position sensor today at all, but these headlights finally turned out good. $30 from Amazon, like amazing. Like, I love it. Still sad I had to take the windshield tint off, but all those others is good enough for me. We're gonna go on a quick little drive right now, and I'm gonna show you how good this new rear suspension is because I'm in love with it. Yeah, so much smoother. And especially if you go into speed and corners, feels amazing. So great. I love it. Like, no side to side at all now like it's great I'm in love with what we did so I'm gonna be done with this now and thanks for watching
watching guys if you can subscribe throw this video a like that'd be great but thanks for watching peace out